Hey guys, welcome back to Tech Love Better Than It's Nori and today we're gonna install Ultimate Nougat S8 port version 2 on the Galaxy S6 Edge and many people were saying that it is wrong to check out so we're gonna install it today so first of all what you're gonna do is we're gonna turn off our device and now we're gonna go into the custom recovery and to do that we're just gonna press volume up key, home key and power key at the same time and now we're gonna let go of the power key so now we're gonna go in wipe and we're gonna go in advanced wipe and now we're gonna select the Dalvik ART cache system data and cache and we're gonna swipe to wipe now we're gonna come out over here and we're gonna go in install and we're gonna select this ultimate nougat s8 full port version 2.0 and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash so the rom does come with the roma installer so you know that there would be some customizations available so we're gonna press next over here agree to this next and you have the change log over here so right now you have the noted applications so that is really great and let's just not select anything over here since we have already wiped our device so next and now you can select your device with or without kernel so i'm gonna go with the kernel because i have used stock kernel for a long time and i want to go with any other and it might give me a better battery life than the stock so i'm gonna go ahead and select this d925 f or i ldn kernel so it might be good kernel so we're gonna check it out so you have the support for the G92 XT and W8 models so whoever you are out there you can install this on your device so next and it does not show what it is installing but it just says not recommended with LDN kernel I don't know what it actually is so I'm just gonna go with no and here you can select the apps that you want so there's a problem over here now so it says that the Bixby says not recommended with LDN kernel so that might be a problem and I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna select the stock kernel now in order to get the Bixby so I'm gonna select this yes over here as well now I'm gonna select the applications that I really want the Google app, the all share, car mode Samsung Cloud, Bixby, Samsung Note, that's it. And you're gonna select your CSE over here. And finally, I see the INS over here, which is the Indian one. So I'm gonna select that and next. And I'm gonna go with the asset camera once again. The asset camera applications looks uh, really elegant to me. So I'm just gonna go with that. So next. And now you have the options of selecting your emojis. So I'm gonna go with the Nova 7.1.1 and I don't really like those extra fonts. I just like to go with the stock one. So I'm gonna go with stock. I'm gonna go with the installed matches and the busy box. So next and next. And the ROM is installing now. So it may take two to three minutes to install the ROMs. So I'll be back when the ROM is done installing. So guys, the ROM is installed now and we're gonna select next and we're gonna reboot our device. So we're gonna reboot our device to system and some of you were asking me how I got this blue S6 Edge icon over here so it came with the ROM that I was using I think it was the gold eagle ROM I just installed the ROM and I got this one I found the way to get a custom boot logo but I didn't find this one so it might just came with the gold eagle ROM but uh, I couldn't find that boot logo anywhere so if I find it, I will make a video about it and you can get that blue boot logo as well. So the ROM is booting up right now and it may take around 10 to 15 minutes. So I'm just gonna put my device aside and I'll be back when it's done booting. So guys, the device just booted up. First of all, the thing that pops up is that you have the Volti logo and it says 4G LTE over here. So the ROM does come with the Volti effects. So that is really, really great. So I'm just gonna quickly set up the device and we'll see how the ROM is actually like. So guys, the device is all set up now and as you can see, it comes with this uh, S8 launcher and it does come with the Bixby as I've selected in the installer 
so the rom looks good but it does not come with this s8 so weather widget so let's see if it actually has that so it actually has that but it is not set by default so it looks good now so now let's get into the settings and about device and you have model number of the s8 plus and you have the android which is 7.0 and the Samsung Experience version 8.1 so this ROM is actually a S8 Plus port so that is really great and the last ROM that we had tested was the Ultimate Nougat version 2.0 that was based on the S6 and the S6 Edges firmware and that was a great ROM too but it looks really nice and I think it is much faster and much smoother than that actually was so let's go into the developers options and try to speed the rom a little more so yeah the rom feels really faster than that rom but if you want to check out the ultimate nougat rom version 2.0's review the link to the video will be right over here please do check it out and you might like that rom because that rom is really stable and this ROM has all of the S8 things that I selected in the installer so that is really great so I think that's it if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you're new here please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to share the video and thanks for watching guys